four, three. From my living room to yours, this is Buff Hussey. Welcome everyone, my name is Debbie Shadani and I'm so happy to be here today for our good grip and quivering quads workout. This is an excellent low impact workout you can do in your apartment and, and, and anywhere else you wanted to do it. What you're gonna need today is a mat, a wall, and two weights or one very heavy weight. We're gonna be doing, um, we're gonna hold those weights for about four minutes. So something that can challenge you. If you have like 30 pound weights and you're used to that, great. I have two 15s. If you have not done much grip strength before and you have two 10s, you can work those out and try um, leveling up each time. Very flexible. Um, we're gonna be doing four exercises, one minute each to create a four minute circuit with a 45 second rest in between. And we're just gonna go, 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 go. And then we will warm up, of course, and we will cool down at the back end. Uh, you can always put this in between some other leg workout that's a little bit more high intensity to sort of warm you up. All right, you ready? Because I sure am. We're gonna start off with our warm up on the mat in five, four, three, two, one, bring yourself down onto your mat, all fours. We're gonna sort of work out our wrists. Go forward and back, forward and back. Nice, strong core. So I'm actively tensing up my core, my abs, like I'm gonna be punched by Dwayne Johnson. I am getting ready <laughs> for the rock to punch me. You're really squeezing here. In three seconds, we're going to lift onto our toes and lift those knees up. Push the shoulders away. If you feel like this is too much on your wrists, come back down into your knees and just work the shoulders there. We're gonna be here for 15 more seconds. This starts to also work out the thighs. We're gonna come up to standing in five, four, nice and proud, three, two, one, Come up to standing, right leg forward, left leg back, hold your arms out to the side, give me a nice lunge, knee stacked behind your toes, and I'm bending that back leg. Excellent, gonna come up to standing, and then step that left leg back again. Up and back, good, up and back. In 10 seconds, we switch sides. We're using our lunges first and foremost, left leg forward, right leg back. Hold it here, align. If this is difficult for you, this is the test. This is why we do our lunges first. If you're wobbling all over the place, you're gonna be holding onto your lunge as best as you can, even maybe using the wall. If you feel like you can do this no problem, you're gonna be doing a nice up and down with me. In 10 seconds, we're gonna get started. We're gonna grab one or both weights. I'm gonna grab both, and we're gonna hit our wall set, three. Two, one, come on over. We can also treat this like it's almost a warm up. This is our nice level one. Hit your wall sit, hold on to those weights. We're here for one minute. Feeling good, feeling sore already. <laughs> Sink those hips down, push the hips back into the wall, shoulder blades nice and open and pushing into the wall as well. Now start to lift one heel, other heel, tick, tock. 30 seconds left. After this wall sit, we go into our reverse lunges, holding those grips. Fifteen seconds. This is where the quads start to feel the burn of one minute. In five seconds, we stand back up. Right leg forward, left leg back, here we go, and push. All right, right leg forward, left leg back. Hold here. If you need the wall, put one weight down, hold the wall. If you can, you're holding onto those grips, you're coming up and back down. I know it seems easy. And kudos to you. In terms of your form, keep your chest nice and tall, don't be leaning forward too much. Three seconds, we switch legs. Good, switch. Okay. 
there's a great amount of literature on people with grip strength being able to live a little bit longer because they can just do more around their day-to-day -day life. This is inspired by a farmer's carry in Spartan races, this type of holding. We're gonna go into a march. Come up to standing right here, right now. Hold on to those weights and come up to a march. In our round one, we'll be doing 30 seconds of this march. In 20 seconds, we're gonna to switch to a lateral lunge. 15 seconds. So a farmer's carry is holding two heavy weights in your hands, hide my 215s, but when we get into some Spartan races like our DECA, we'll be doing 40 pound weights. Lateral lunge, right arm forward, left knee bends, come up, switch. Nice tall chest as best as you can, be soft. We have one more exercise here, horse squat. Keep holding on to those weights. Three, two, one. You love it, you know it, you know your horse squat, right? Arm forward, knees pointing out. Wider stance, so your knees are staying behind your toes, pointing over two. If you find your knees collapsing inwards, actively push them out and hold. Nice strong core, strong chest, good. Switch sides. Twenty-five seconds. We get to put those weights down. We get to rest for forty-five. Great first round. Wherever you are, take a deep breath in. Deep breath out. Five seconds left. Three, two. One, excellent. Put those weights down. Good. And then waffle the hands side to side. Give me a march. 30 seconds, we're gonna start again. How are your hands? Does it feel like those were, you know, you weren't too crazy at the end? Keep those weights in hand and we're gonna do it again. If you felt like that was way too much, Hold one weight, focus on just um, the right hand or you can switch it in between. And if you feel like you can do more weight than that, I want you to grab it. 10 seconds, we go back to the wall. Here we go in three, two, one. Here we go, sit it at the wall. All right, are you feeling pretty good? If you feel like you can also hold those weights and you can give me some hammer curls too, we're gonna try to go and give me 10 hammer curls here, depending on our weights that you have. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, you got it, 10. All right, hold those weights down. Push into your left leg, lift that right heel up. Five, four, three, two, one, switch. Other side, five, four, three, two, hold for five. We go to reverse lunges in three, two, one, push. Right leg forward, left leg back, up and back down. Ten seconds, we switch sides. Squeeze the weights and dumbbells into your hands so that they're not just resting in the fingertips. You're holding them. Switch sides. Like you cannot drop them. Ten. 
Nice work. You have the option of going right into your lateral lunge for more advanced, or you can go into your um, march that we did before. Gonna stay alternating sides. Go. Push, keep the chest up and lifted. Feet are pointing straight forward. Knees are following suit. Try not to let them collapse inwards. Really think about pushing out, squeezing the glutes. 25 seconds left. You got this. Good job coming here and continuing our ramping up into our New Year's resolutions. It all begins with your morning ritual. Here we go. We go back to our horse squat in three, two, one, horse squat. I don't know about you, but these grocery bags that I'm holding, these 15 pound weights are making my forearms scream. You got this. Five seconds, we switch. Other hand forward, drop it down. All right, Buff Hussies, Kaya, Katie, Rachel, Archna, so happy for you. Nina, welcome back, hold it down, 10 seconds. Nine, eight, squeeze those glutes, hold it here, five, Four, three, two, one, bring it up. Good. Put those weights down. Doing great. Shake it out. Stretch, hands open, hands close, hands open, hands close continuously. Deep breath in, hands up high. Forward, hold, bend, and lift back up. 25 seconds. All right, nice work. So this is our, I think of this as a great intermediate level class. It has all the components for our quads, for our grip strength, for our form. Grab your weights in five seconds, we hit back into the wall. Let's go for our bicep curls again. Here we go, drop it down and begin. But you could make this an inter, uh, advanced level class. You start to hold those weights during the rest. You also might want to just focus on one leg the whole time during our last two circuits, one minute right leg. Push. Nice work. Good, last bicep curl here. Hold that right leg out. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop it left. Five, four, three, two, one. Push, reverse lunges. Step it, right leg forward, left leg back. Now we've been going up and down. We can make this a little harder. Tap gently to the floor. 15 seconds. The deeper the lunge, the more difficult it is for your quadriceps to have to hold that. And that's when the quivering becomes a quake. <laughs> Three, two, one, switch. So silent here in your apartment, wherever you are, 15 seconds. Last 10. Oh, smokes. Five, four, three, two, one. Level up. Come up. Lateral lunge. We hold this lateral lunge this side. 30 seconds. We 
We can do the same thing here. Hold 15 seconds. Gentle pulse, 10. You see me keep looking at the clock. I'm like, let's go. Three, two, one, switch. Good, go. I'm with you. Fifteen seconds for your power. Dip it down. Dip it low for Kristen and Milian, y'all. Go. Horse squat in five. Three, two, one. Come up. Good. Right down and back up. Widen the legs as much as you want. How are those hands doing? Hold it for 10. Hold it right here. That's right. You got more in the tank. You got your last 30 seconds here. Switch arms right then and there. Good. You got more in the tank, more in the legs. Lift up the heels. 20 seconds left to go. Chest up tall. You saw that. Nice. 10 seconds left. Dip it. 10. Nine, eight, seven, becomes a bar class. Be also easy. Three, two, one, put it up and put them down. Oh, round of applause for you guys. Great job. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Good. March hold. I'm holding onto the back. Um, Onto my fingertips, pulling them down and backwards. Other side. Nice, nice, nice. Come down, fold your mat in half. Left knee down, right leg forward, double mat. Excellent. For you, just Tolman, sink your hips down. And then belt buckle up, back pocket down, definitely from you. Nice quadricep stretch we have right here. If you have a foam roller, highly suggest foam rolling out the quads, hamstrings, and even forearms. You're creating that pelvic tilt to get into your quadricep stretch. Now crescent lunge here, down, flat, square the hips. Great job, right leg forward. Now right leg back, left leg forward, hips back, good. Belt buckle up, back pocket down, push. And then you can push yourself a little further forward to feel your quadricep stretch. I wanna hear what you think. Let me know and please drop a comment if you liked that workout. So low impact and still so strong. Crescent lunge here for our last 10 seconds. If you have time for one more, because this will be two minutes of cool down, I recommend one more. Stretch and roll your mat. You come into your cat and cow, and then you flip over one hand. You flip over the other hand and push forward and back, getting into the forearms. If that feels too intense on the wrists, you can always do what we did before. Gently pull and you be the controller. Those forearms. Great job, everyone. My name is Debbie Shadani. This is Buff Hussey. Keep it strong, y'all, especially as we come into the new year. Thank you.